Toro just in front, Igloo's hanging in. Toro in front, he's holding Igloo at bay. And Toro's gonna be too good. Toro goes to the line to win it a half length to Igloo. Yeah, there's a lot of good horses come through Penzers in their time. Toro started out, I suppose, in a fairly modest way, really. Like, he, uh, he didn't have any big wraps on him at the time. Uh, but he, uh, he came here, he'd, he'd had a start at Ballarat and uh, came here with uh, uh, you know, pretty fair credentials. We were a very well-bred horse. We had an old slow horse in the race, but he, he'd been showing us a little bit sort of thing and we thought we might be able to uh, nearly knock a race off at Pencers. <laughs> and uh, of course, uh, Torto steps out and shows us you know, uh, what a race horse should look like. What do you say about a horse as good as that? Like he was just an outstanding horse. Poor old Bob Agony, you know, he, he trained there at Duncal. He, he, there was no bells and whistles on his training programs. He was just a, a good old fashioned trainer. You know, I'd put him and Pura Marker and horses like that in a, in a bit of an elevated category. But uh, uh, yeah, he, he was good stuff.